that this is a private it's a private land I guess so yeah I'm not on it okay so why do you have to take photographs of it so welcome back to the channel guys today we're here in Birmingham a b6 postcode taking a look at hydroforce on Google it says hydroforce hydraulics UK hydraulic equipment supplier hydroforce Power forward. Well, excuse me, can you ask why you're filming? Sorry, mate. Can I ask why you're filming the site? Just filming. I just want some video clips. For any particular reason? Just to put them on the, onto my computer. Just to put all the little video clips together. Okay, are you on? Make like a little video. Are you with a, your own company? Sorry? Do you have your own company or something? No. No. Why? Do you work for the company? No? No, so it's just personal use. Uh, I just want to show a few people. That's all. Show a few people the building. Yeah, Hydroforce, Hydraulics. <laughs> I'm not sure why, why, why would you need to do that? You don't need to know any more than that. Just, I'm not coming on your site. I'm just yeah. staying outside. Okay. Surely that's good enough, isn't it? Mm, it seems a bit suspicious while you're doing this. Right. right. Class that as suspicious, just filming. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, it's never happened before, so right. it's just a bit. It's well, like, odd, isn't it? you know this camera here, lot. Yeah. Let me show you something. Do you know if I zoom right in? Okay. You see that? That yeah. says. Why do you need to know? That? Maveco, yeah. And then next to it, we've got. Ship to Sweden. That's going to Sweden. Wow. Do you know what I mean? So it's a little video on the outside and it, I can find out more than what the website tells me. And then I can put all the little video clips together. Okay, could you just wait here for a moment? No. You're detaining me. No, yeah, I'm just asking you to wait. No, no, I'm busy. All right. Sorry? I'm not, I'm not, not waiting there, I'm busy. I'm doing the video, I've got lots to do. Okay. All right, yeah? Are you, are you really security? Yeah, I'm security. And you really think this is like that suspicious that like you want to get a manager? I just, I've, just, I've been working here for a while and I've never seen anyone video recording the, the site before so I was just asking where you've been. So. Yeah, and I've, I've been very open and honest with you. I've even shown you what the camera can see. That's the type of thing I want to see because it tells me more than the website. You get that, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, so that's it. I'm not coming on your site. I'm not going to nicko, not robbing the place. I'm just staying outside doing an interesting video that I like to do. And I would have thought, as security, that would be enough information for you to just say, okay, fair enough. Are you, have you not got one of them blue SIA licenses? Yeah, I do. Is it not on display? It's in my bag, I think. Yeah, see, normally the, the, the security staff that are professional and really know what they're doing, Yeah. they do everything they're supposed to do. Because it's by law, you have to wear it, you know? You have to have it on display, by law. Okay. I'm filming from a public place isn't against the law. So if anyone's doing anything wrong right now, it's you. But I'm not picking on you. So, all right, I'm, I'm off anyway. I'm going to be in the area for 10 minutes. So, we're all good? Uh, yeah, I was, it's just a bit, I've never seen it before. That's what I was just asking, isn't it? Yeah, so have I now reassured you or not? A bit, a bit. But I just thought like, is it for like a YouTube? Is it, are you a person or a photographer? Does that matter But where, where it's going? I'm going to show it to people, so yeah. whether it's being shown to TikTok, Facebook, YouTube, to a conference, to a competitor, whoever I'm going to show it to, doesn't matter. The fact that I'm outside doing a lawful activity, that's what does matter. Okay. Do you get me? Yeah. You're focusing on the wrong things, and you ain't even got an SIA license on display. Yeah. Everything all right, chaps? Yeah. yeah. All good. It would be better yeah. if he had his SIA license on display, you know, the, the badge that they have to wear by law. Why are you asking if you don't mind me asking? Well, he's started to ask me questions and questioning what I'm doing, so I'm just, right. I'm just giving it a little bit back, that's can, all. Can, do you mind me asking you what you're doing then? Well, would you like to, in your professional capacity, as a yeah. SIA license card, He said relay. it's video recording for personal use, so that you can show people the videos. He showed me that you can zoom in on the, the packages and get more information by coming here filming than they can on the well, why, do you, why would you need to do that, sorry, if you don't mind me asking? Why would you need to do that? Well, 
It's not about needing, it's about being able to. No, but what so, would you need to do with that was my question. That, well, that's a bit personal. That's well, my this, is a, this is a private a private land, I guess, so... Yeah, I'm not on it. Okay, so why do you have to take photographs of it? It's a, yeah. it's a reasonable question. Yeah, I'm creating a video to find out more about Hydroforce, hydraulics. Okay, for whom? Hold on. If, if you want to know the details no, of my, yeah that you're wanting to know the details yeah, of my client yeah, yeah. so you I understand need to you, the police or something because i don't know what you're doing i'm in the middle of explaining and then you start a conversation no, with i don't him. think you are explaining i think you've been awkward with this guy he's only doing his job right do you what understand you? client confidentiality i don't care to be honest with you well if you don't care so who are you you're starting to be rude who are you you don't care so no, i don't care you tell me who you are then so who, who are you right so you are yeah, my, my name's lee walker i work at hydro force yeah so you're yeah, lee walker private land and private company stuff. These two security guards are into the job as well, so I want to know who you are. Why have they not got their SIA license on display? I don't, I don't know, I'm not a security it, guard. Who are you? By law, they have to wear it. So I've just explained to them that <laughs> they're breaking the law, but I'm not, because I'm outside on a public footpath who are you? making a video. Okay, can I trust you with my personal details? Well, I, I don't, who are you? If I tell you my name, that's my personal you've information. My you've clearly got it on display yeah, absolutely. for I the public mind. to see in a public area. Yeah. If I give you my name, can I trust you with it? But who are you then? Because you will be a data handler and you're subject to GDPR. Do you want my name? Who, who are you? Yeah. Do you want my name? Yes. Right. Can I trust you to keep my personal information? Can I trust you to keep my personal information I'm not secure? Say else, thanks. Thank you. Yeah, I'm just so, saying else. You're recording this, yeah? And you haven't got my permission to record this, by the way, just for your camera. All right. From a public place. My permission from a public guys, place, we can film what we like. Guys. I'm here to make a video about Hydroforce. I'm going to use the zoom on the camera to find out as much as I can because the website doesn't give me all the information that I need. Okay? So I've saw on some of the labels that you ship to Sweden. Yes. Yeah, so you've got customers in Sweden and the website don't say that. So I'm here, staying on the outside. I will film everything that I can see from the public footpath. I'll put it on wherever it's going to go. Show my... You can disclose that information. Well, if anybody, if anybody sees the video, they might send you the link. And then at that point, at that point, you'll know where it's gone. Step onto the pavement, though. Okay. Number one to get run over. All right. So I've been very reasonable with you. I've explained yeah. far more than I need to, but you yeah. are not getting my personal details because okay, I cannot fine. trust you. That's all. Okay, it's fine. Because you've got my personal details, I'm on your camera as well, am I? You've come out on a public footpath that's with your fine. name showing. It's not my fault. We just want to see you, are, my friend. That was yeah. all right. You won't tell us, so that's fine. Okay. So for your record, you won't tell us who you are. No, you're not having my personal details because okay, I can't trust fine. that you keep it secure. That's on your record as well, isn't it? Yeah. No, you're not entitled to no, the, remember fine. the public's so name. Not come on to the public. No, it's I've not already told you that, and I before right? they arrived, I reassured you on that. Security-wise, I'm no threat, but I will be making a video in the in the area for 20 minutes. And you won't tell us who you are, so we don't know where it's going. We don't know what website's going to end. No, because you're not entitled to know what I do with my video. That's fine. I'm just asking the question. Whilst you're here, I will. No, I'm not going to talk to you anymore. Okay, no problem. Come on then, guys. We'll go back in. I don't want to. No, that's fine. You don't have to listen. Don't have to listen. But I'm going to say it. Yeah, thank you. My drone always goes over to finish the video. So if you do see the drone in the air, it's gonna be in the air for five minutes. In about 10 minutes time, the drone will go up. That gets me behind the, behind the back, areas that I wouldn't normally be able to see from the public footpath. Private areas? Or yeah, areas. the private areas, the behind the scenes stuff. Okay, guys, I don't think else If it does prove there. a health and safety risk to us, we will All right, take it down. Much, if it proves the health and safety. How will you take it down? If it proves the health and safety. <laughs> I don't think you'll be taking it down, my friend. There we go. Another bunch of employees or bosses that feel that they're entitled to know everything about your business, which they are clearly not. So let's carry on, shall we? Carry on where we left off. So we've got electrical waste down in the far left. Orange crates. Gray crates. And there we go, another sign. Kite packaging. So they're obviously using kite packaging. Let's see what else we can read, shall we? So Maveco and all their part numbers, that must be one of their customers. 
Turks it a GL Italy PMC Pol Poland Dana EU Belgium Italy again in France Bob FR But normally they do not release information like this, do they? About all their customers. India there. Germany. And what's that logo? Can't quite make it out. And then over at the back. Sweden, Sweden, Germany, Germany. And a forklift carrying lots of these specialised pallets. It's really not a normal pallet, that. But it's gone very quiet now. The sun is shining. A perfect time to get David up and see what this place looks like from above. So as always, we've checked on drone assist. We are still in the Birmingham CTR, which does not apply to a 249 gram drone. Hydroforce. Well, let's have a look at you then, shall we? So nice and high, 44 meters. You can clearly see where I'm standing. Public footpath crossing over the road, double yellow lines, the lot. All the hydraulic parts labeled up with the customer name, visible from the public footpath. and lots of pallets and stillages that they use to move them around inside. Some sort of chemical store down there. With some compactors for the waste and some bins up against the fence. But the main building itself is here. And what a size, wow. A lot bigger than it looks from the road. The car park is absolutely rammed, look. Just shows you how many people are inside assembling all these hydraulic products. I've not even looked on their website yet. I'll give you some interesting facts after the drone flight. So they have got lots of public areas going around this place. Where I'm standing right now, there's a public footpath here. There's obviously public access down here as well. So maybe they've had issues in the past, some break-ins maybe, I don't know. But you can't suspect everybody of being a criminal, can you? And what makes them think they're entitled? to your name. So there you are, Hydroforce, your whole site in one shot. So with Hydroforce down in the bottom centre, let's have a little pan around, see what's in the local area. A much better shot of Spaghetti Junction there. Look at that. And it's only 12 o'clock on a Tuesday. It's not that busy there. Keep panning around. Those of you that know the Birmingham area, you can press pause at any time. We'll also do a 360 degree photo for Google Maps. So if you've not clicked on that yet, the link will be in the description. You can move it around and zoom in on stuff. So that's it. Drone footage complete. We did a little bit from the website. 
Hydroforce was first established in Chicago, USA in 1985. The Birmingham site is the European headquarters of the business, now based at the Advanced Manufacturing Hub in Aston. Hydroforce remains a privately owned company with manufacturing facilities across the world. So this place actually turns out to be the European headquarters of the business. Wow. The location of the DJ Audits Keyring on this video is just under that rock just there. If you are one of the first people to watch this video and you do want a keyring, good luck with that. And we will leave that video there. What do you reckon? Although we go out of our way to reassure security that we're no threat, just give them a little bit of basic information about what we're doing out on the public footpath creating a video. That should be enough in my opinion. And when they want to know more details, despite them not even accepting what I've told them, you know, they're not saying, oh, okay, yeah, that sounds interesting. They just think we're lying, think we're up to no good. So, and the fact that he's not got his SIA license on display, I still think now, you know, is he SIA licensed? Is he one of these security guards that have got a fake license or no license at all? You never know, do you? But the fact that he doesn't even know the basic photography rights from the outside makes me wonder. And then the bosses came out, you know, with that entitlement. You know, everybody does what they say inside the place, but I don't need to do what you say out here. I don't need to give you my name. I can't trust you with my name. And they don't even deserve the YouTube channel. So anyway, that's my take on it. Let me know what you think in the comments below. So if you have enjoyed that video, do give it a thumbs up for me and I'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye-bye for now.